Hey guys, it's Cryptomia Analysis coming at you with an update video on Dojo on Mars. So I had a pretty busy day today at work, which is why I didn't make it in the morning or the update video in the morning. And I made it in the app, I mean, obviously the evening. So it looks like we're having some sort of capitulation right now. Uh, obviously, Dojo on Mars looks like it's going down. Uh, it's, it looks like it's going to zero, right? But no worries, no need to stress. But maybe you should if you went all in and don't have any capital on the side. So I don't know what to tell you if that's what you did. But let's look at the RSI and the stock RSI. We can clearly see that, you know, it, you know, in the hindsight, it kind of, uh, this, it's funny how, you know, that this fell and we actually came back and tagged the 236 and then we, come, we, we went, like basically we got rejected. So from here to here, uh, this, I mean, I guess I really wouldn't count this wick, but same thing, we came up to 236 and we got rejected. So, I have to say that the next area of support, drum roll, is going to be, oh wow, like we've said for the last however many months, um, a while now actually, that the next area of support is going to be 1288, so I do think that maybe we might get something like this, where we come back over here, and uh, just like here, like, you know, we're going to get oversold. I really think that's actually going to put us in the over, like, in the red. So that's going to be around a 14% drop. So yeah, I mean, I don't, it might even go lower. Honestly, at this point, it might be going somewhere here. I mean, it seems like it. It feels that way, right? If for everyone that has, you know, their Bitcoin, uh, their Bitcoin amount uh, live, it feels like this thing's about to go all the way down to uh, adding a zero nine. So, yeah, I mean, what would that do? So, point one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, no, sorry, seven, nine. There we go. And then I need seven, six, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. So, 76 bill, seven point six billion would be six hundred and eighty four dollars, which would obviously put you or me, you, me at uh, an even 50 billion. Uh, so, you know, that's like, I I said I was gonna do 13, so let's just stick with 13, uh, which is 988, 991 after fees. But uh, I'm not gonna do it yet because I just don't think, like I'm not gonna deposit it yet or do it yet because I just don't think it's gonna actually hit. But here's the thing. Gemini has its own ecosystem. So the thing is that like, if somebody like on Gemini or if someone's watching this video and it's like, oh, I have a hundred billion on Gemini and I'm not feeling it anymore. They can go over here and sell, you know, or, you know, whatever ask, uh, sell. And then, um, you know, seven point six six k right now. But uh, basically that's gonna push the price down on Gemini, not necessarily all of the other markets, but uh, it's definitely worth noting that maybe it is smart to put in a buy order at 13 right now, but I kind of want to see like I like what if it goes lower right? And I hate that, but what if it goes lower? Like I want to get it for as like cheap as possible, like I said before, because we already have like I already have my amount right, so I don't want to like I don't I really don't want to get shredded and wrecked anymore. So I want to get it for as cheap as possible, and and the only time I'm gonna get it. So even if I see this at 13 and this isn't in the red, like it hasn't been for a while now, I'm not gonna buy it. I think that when we hit the red, it does mark a bottom when we're in a bull run. Um, so just keep that in mind. Uh, and yeah, that's it. I mean, again, until we get over two, there's nothing bullish about Dojo on Mars. So it really looks like we're gonna go back down, but it, it feels horrible, it feels bad, but you know what, it's okay. Just imagine, again, Imagine if you bought here or here and you rode this wave like exactly like we did and it's right back to where it started and we're literally missing this thing. So we're literally just missing this giant move up, right? So we're probably like here, right? Where we're capitulating, bounce, going back down and then getting on out of here. Um, but again, I just don't know. I hope that all made sense and I hope, uh, I hope uh, you know, if you're feeling discouraged, if you're like, you know what, I'm just gonna sell and buy back later, you could try that, but I, I personally wouldn't do that. Again, I don't think that um, that's a good play. I think that at this point, we just need to like hold it out and 
uh, wait until it reverses because we're already hanging hanging around the RSI being oversold. So again, the best thing you could do is just accumulate and um, keep buying the dips. But none of this is financial advice, so this is just my opinion, and clearly I'm showing you my play. Oh, look at that! Exactly. Look, someone just capitulated. Literally, someone just capitulated on the on the stream. So, um, or not stream, but you know what I mean. So maybe I should, maybe I should actually just put in my buy order. That's 13. No, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna be patient. I'm gonna exercise patience. But wow, look at all this selling pressure. Um, anyway. So, where was, oh yeah, let's check the uh, ether scan. So let's go to holders, Binance peg token, let's see if they added any, nope, still 10 days ago on the transaction. Oh nice, we have one buy, but that's just a bounce. And then let's go down here to the burn wallet. Obviously we all know if you follow me and follow my channel, you know that I'm going to burn this month when I get my first check from YouTube. So uh, we'll see. We'll see how much it is and, and and all that good stuff. So it's probably like 20 or 30 bucks. I don't, I don't know yet, but we'll see. So yeah, so no, uh, no transaction to dead wallet yet. But you know what? Honestly, I'm really tempted to buy some right now because literally the Bitcoin looks like it's capitulating. But let me see where Bitcoin's at, actually. I know I don't normally do this, but I do this on my on like my side before before I buy because I want to see where the RSI is. Yeah, like how how much lower can this go? Sorry guys, this isn't a BTC video, but it, I mean it clearly everything revolves around Bitcoin, so give me a second, especially if I'm going to put a thousand dollars in. Yeah, so what is this like? 57k so we have support at 57k so yeah i mean okay so let's let's think about it so bitcoin goes down to uh 57k uh elon goes down to 13 if bitcoin falls lower though it needs to stay over 44k but see that's the thing if that happens i think that if that happens i think that dojo on mars is going to add a zero and be between eight so eight and nine so that's the thing it's like oh like how low do you think it's gonna go? Um, anyway, we'll see. I'll, I'll, I'll obviously make a video if I do buy it because I said I'm going to. So um, obviously you guys will know when I buy. I think it's cool to kind of show that too. Um, and otherwise, uh, other than that, that's basically it. We're, we're capitulating, nothing's good, it sucks, but we just kind of have to hold and uh, hope that, you know, we reverse uh, we reverse soon, so uh, please like. I'm trying to like drag it on because literally I'm looking at my phone. Bitcoin's about to be at 58k, so maybe, maybe you know what? Maybe we'll make this video a little bit longer, and I'll just see if this thing, if this thing capitulates, because yeah, 13 would put it here. Damn, I can't believe it went back down here. That's unbelievable. That's just so crazy to me. But if we break this low, we're, yeah, we're definitely gonna go over here between eight and nine. So, okay, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. But uh, if I do, I'm gonna make a video and put in my buy order and basically, I mean, regardless, you guys will see next time I show my uh, available Elon. But uh, we're just gonna have to, we'll just gonna have to make another video for that because again, I don't wanna do it right now. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for all of your supports. And we broke, and we broke 58k. So uh, we broke 59k. So we're in 58k. Okay. You know what? Is is this actually gonna capitulate? Sorry guys, you guys don't have to watch. But this is like the suspense right now. Because yeah, like what what would that be? So buy. Let's just do 12, right? Like whatever. If someone's gonna actually sell that much. Uh, let's look at the order book. Oh man, no, see, someone's someone's buying 166 billion tokens at 41. Dude, my thing's not gonna hit it. I'm sorry for wasting your guys' time. I, I have to wait until this, like there's no liquidity, until like there's no buys, and then I'll know that like it's gonna get pushed down. So I'm sorry for wasting your guys' time. But, 
again, we'll see. Imagine if someone sells that, though. That would be crazy. But um, please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support. Uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Uh, hopefully, the next video will mark the bottom, and we'll just take it from there. Uh, have a great night, everyone. Have a great 4th of July. I'm going to make my video early tomorrow. I really appreciate it. I'm working on my webcam, so soon I will be able to actually use my webcam and that way you guys can put a put a face to crypto meow analysis and you can see my cats and you can see the the motivation behind crypto meow analysis and and then i could do some cool stuff with my ad revenue um and with my elon uh with cats because who says like you're only limited to doing crypto videos like i want to do whatever i want like and this is how i see uh, me doing what i really want which is helping cats anyway i promise this is the last thing I'm going to say. Please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support. I will catch you guys in the next video.